house. Uh. Yeah, my daddy lived right across the street from Farrakhan house. So I went to my daddy's house to smoke weed before we went to the airport, and Farrakhan security saw that it was me, and they came to greet. Yeah, Dumb. yeah, 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 they came right. to greet. And, and Farrakhan told them, y'all better leave, y'all don't bother. So they under order. Now, I know they ain't like them other uh, Shiite Muslims. The black Muslims over here is broken in spirit. They ain't no motherfucking super Obama kind of. Mm. They ain't really, they ain't going to nobody in the name mm. of the religion. Yeah, they'll beat you up. Yeah, they'll jump on you. But these Muslims over here ain't going to take no airplane and run it into no motherfucking building these black Muslims. Elijah Muhammad prohibit Muslims from carrying guns. So the black Muslims don't pose a threat. Yeah, they want to hurt me because I'm 5'9", 120 pounds, and it's easy to hurt me. But you've never seen the Muslims during no police shooting from Trayvon Martin to Mike Brown to Breonna Taylor. You never seen the bow tie in uniform, in sync, hollering the police, no justice or else. So let me break this shit down, homie, since they think the Muslim homie, you ain't never seen them go against the gangbangers. Because the Muslim the Muslim religion allowed the street to still play gangster in the name of Akbar, Allah, Bismillah, the rock man, the Raheem bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> they still let them push the street codes. That's why they can still do what they do as Muslims. That's why when you see whether it's the basketball player, the boxing, the rapping, or the street, when they embrace Islam, you don't see no real transformation in their actions. These remain the same. Yeah, they give up eating pork, but they keep sucking <laughs> they keep eating ass. They'll stick their tongue in any hoe's mouth. It's like almost convenient. Man, that suck. That suck. That they bleed for seven days. That just as filthy as that pig. You sucking corn and eat, eat uh, ass. Uh. So don't act like uh 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 Allah Muhammad brother man don't eat ass. That's fecal matter. E. coli bacteria. You don't think that's worse than the Pope? <laughs> I, I, you know, so they will be talking, homie. And I, I always wonder where that came from, though. Where did the indoctrination of that come from here in America? The slave masters, because you have to understand, homie, the Arabs were the first slave masters over the Africans. They, the Arabs are the ones who showed the Europeans how to do this slave trade. Mm. So it was the Arabs mm. who introduced Arab Islam Muslim to their slaves. The Christian, the Christian came with his yeah, say so, Bulgaria, boy. During that council, right? We don't know if none of these books are true, homie, because for one, when we get them, they're copyrighted. Uh. Think about that, homie. Whoa. Every Bible and every Quran, it's copyrighted. It's copyrighted. So it's been edited, it's been rewrote, even in the translation. When they translate the words, the words don't have the same meanings in English that it does in Hebrew. And that. Come on, homie. Mm. It's different. So I, I call bull on all them because really? I watched all these go. They convert. These ain't born in Islam. These are converted 